वेलकम टू अवर न्यू वीडियो दैट इज एमसीक्यूज ऑन वायरोलॉजी और वायरसेस एंड दिस इज द पार्ट 11 ऑफ दिस सीरीज ऑफ वीडियोस ऑन वायरोलॉजी ओके सो द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज व्हिच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज आरएनए वायरस ऑप्शंस आर वैक्सीनिया वायरस एंटेरोवायरस एडिनोवायरस और हर्पिस वायरस एंड द राइट आंसर इज ऑप्शन बी सो दैट इज enterovirus so the enterovirus is a rna virus here okay so move on to the next question that is plant viruses can be grown in protoplast culture whole plants culture of separated cells or any of the above and the right answer is option d that is any of the above so plant viruses can be grow in protoplast culture whole plants culture of cultures of separated cells okay so move on to the next when cultivated in plant tissue cultures viruses produces a characteristic tissue lesion called lawn plaque pock or necrotic lesion and the right answer is option d that is necrotic lesion so when cultivated in plant tissue culture viruses produce a characteristic tissue lesion called necrotic lesion okay so move on to the next viruses can be purified by differential centrifugation method or gradient centrifugation method or precipitation method or any of the above method and the right answer is option d that is any of the above method so virus can be purified by differential centrifugation method gradient centrifugation method or precipitation method move on to the next question that is which of the following are more sensitive to enzymatic degradation by nucleases options are viruses free nucleic acid of viruses both a and b are equally sensitive or practically they are insensitive to nucleases and the right answer is option b that is free nucleic acid of viruses so free nucleic acid of viruses are more sensitive to enzymatic degradation by nucleases so next question is virus particles can be directly counted with the help of electron microscope precipitation unit crystallization method or cytopathic method and the right answer is option a that is electron microscope so viral particles can be directly counted with the help of electron microscope so next question is which of the following is cheap and very much common indirect method of counting virus particles and the options are hemagglutination method cytopathic method crystallization method or isotope method and the right answer is option a that is hemagglutination method so hemagglutination method is cheap and very much common indirect method of counting virus particles so the next question is which of the following is dna virus options are retrovirus rheovirus rabies virus or herpes virus and the right answer is option d that is herpes virus so herpes virus is a dna virus so move on to the next question virus having isosceptral symmetry is coronavirus influenza virus herpes virus or rhabdovirus and the right answer is option c that is herpes virus so virus having isosceptral symmetry is herpes virus okay so move on to the next question that is the largest virus is pox virus foot and mouth disease virus or polio virus or rabies virus and the right answer is option a that is pox virus so pox virus is the largest virus next question is example of small rna virus is rotavirus arena virus measles virus or polio virus and the right answer is option d that is polio virus so polio virus is the small rna virus so next one is example of small dna virus is pox virus herpes virus adenovirus retrovirus and the right answer is 
option C that is adenovirus is an example of small DNA virus. Next one. Which virus has double stranded RNA genome? So options are influenza virus, rheovirus, rabies virus or polio virus and the right answer is option B that is rheovirus. So rheovirus is a double stranded RNA virus. So move on to the next question that is a dilution that consists of dose large enough to destroy 50% of host cell or organisms by virion is called infectious dose, lethal dose, death point dose or lytic dose and the right answer is option B that is lethal dose. So a dilution or a dose that consists of large enough to destroy 50% of host cell so by virion that is known as lethal dose. Okay. So move on to the next question that is a dilution that consists of dose large enough to infect 50% of host cell or organisms by virion under the condition employed is called infectious dose, lethal dose, death point dose or lytic dose and the right answer is option A that is infectious dose. So here the term is infect, infect 50% of the host that's why it is called infectious dose. But here to destroy 50% dose that 50% of host cell that's why it is called lethal dose. Okay. So this is the concept. So move on to the next question that is which of the following is or are applicable to virion size. So options are it ranges from 10 nanometer to 400 nanometer. The smallest virus is as small as ribosome while largest is and large as smallest bacterium okay so generally because of their minute size they cannot be visualized in compound microscope okay so or last option is all are the authentic facts and the right answer is option d it is all are the authentic facts about the virion size or virus size okay so move on to the next question that is which of the following is largest virus by size so options are vaccinia virus polio virus birds flu virus or swine flu virus and the right answer is option a that is vaccinia virus so vaccinia virus is largest virus by size so move on to the next one that is a viral nucleic acid along with protein coat together form so viral nucleic acid along with protein coat together form nucleocapsid nucleosome nucleoplasm or neoplasm and the right answer is option a that is nucleocapsid so viral nucleic acid plus protein coat together known as nucleocapsid so next one which of the following structural feature helps viruses in protecting genetic material and aids in transfer between host cells and the options are neoplasm lipid layer capsid or nucleosome and the right answer is option c that is capsid so capsid where the, it is a structural feature help viruses in protecting genetic material and aids in transfer between host cell so this is a role of capsid so move on to the last question of this video that is DNA virus which does not replicate in host cell nucleus is adenovirus, pox virus, herpes virus or paramyxovirus and the right answer is option B that is pox virus. So DNA virus which does not does not replicate in host cell nucleus is called pox virus. Okay. So these are all 20 questions in this video. So thank you for watching this video.